Hey y'all, welcome back to another video. So today we did a detail makeup look on this look right here. You know, this camera is the smoothing, smoothing camera at this point. <laughs> so you really can't get like the feel. I hope you like it, even though the smoothing feature is on my nerves. Anywho, let's get into the video. Let's get into this detail makeup look. Let's see if I can find a cute way to clip this out the way. <laughs> I just ordered those band clips. They like the little flat clip. I wasn't feeling the clips, but yeah. So first off, I go in. Um, I don't do my eyebrows like I used to anymore. Oh my gosh, the lash is coming off. I don't do my eyebrows like I used to. I've been using the Refi Brow Sculpt. I also use this the Brow Glue by NYX, and I got the color, is this black? Yeah, black. I just brush them up. I supposed to have eliminated my brows, but I'm gonna do it tomorrow. I'm gonna use something to um, like smooth it out, but honestly, I'm just gonna use my finger. Let me take a sip. All right, so I haven't been using primer lately. I don't know why, but I use primer. I either go in with this e.l.f. Power Grip, or I use this Putty Poreless by e.l.f. I really like this one. And I already moisturized my face. Moisturizer is key because you don't want your skin to be dry and you applying products on your face. It ain't gonna be right. So let me rub this in because this is thick as you can see. It's giving sunscreen. So hold on. All right, so you're gonna have a white cast on your face, but it's okay because you're about to cover it up. Hourglass one, the or one. Radiant Glow, Milani Glow. These kind of do the same thing. I'm gonna go in with this out first. So I started doing my makeup like this and I really liked how it looked. So let's go back. This is a dupe for the Charlotte Tilbury. And this is like really, really cute to wear by itself. If you want that no makeup, makeup days. So I think I'm gonna go in. I'm gonna use the Dior foundation today. I always like shake up your foundation. I like this one because I have the squeezy tube on it. It's easy to apply. I don't know how sanitary that is, but I'm gonna take this precision makeup brush. And this out. For concealer, I love the Born This Way. I use the shade Golden Bay Shade Vanilla. Put it here. While this is sitting, getting tacky, I'm gonna do my eyebrows. I'm gonna carve them out with the same concealer. It's just a flat concealer brush. I love Morphe brushes. To blend out my the concealer under my brows, I use a real technique. Um, this is called what is this called? I got two of them. It's the deluxe crease brush, and this is how it looks. For the top of my brow, y'all yeah, have a weird thing. Uh, I can't use the, the one I use for under my brow. I use this brush, I forgot what it's called. It's really cheap. It's, it's flat, but it's round. And it helped me able to go around the brow. I blend out my under eye last. I absolutely hate the whiteness around my mouth. Oops, so I go back in with the foundation brush. Now I'm gonna take a brush. This is by Real Technique. This is a setting brush. This is how the shape look. My brush is dirty, so I mind it. And I just blend out the edges first. This is nice. Oh, I wish I could see for real without this smoothie. So 
I just make my way up to the top part. And I learned not to blend my concealer in all the way too much because I blend it away. Yeah, I'm leaning to look at the mirror. <laughs> but still, let y'all see. After I blend in with the brush, I go in with the beauty sponge just to make sure it's blended. All right, now it's time for cream contour. I use the black opal concealer right here. Okay, hazelnut. I mixed up both because black opal is kind of too dark and hazelnut is kind of too light. Just going with the sponge. Ah, uh, TikTok always changing stuff up. So we used to blend like, then they like, no, put it higher, than your, put it higher than your actual contour. And I start, I like how it looked down here. Oh, my camera getting hot. So I added the darker one. <laughs> and when the guy had did his makeup, he did it this way and he also did it the way that TikTok have us doing, putting our contour higher. And the face was snatched when he put it down where it's supposed to go. <laughs> it looks so good. You need to stop TikTok to change the game. So you're making us do all this stuff. Mm -mm. Stick to what we know. Cause it look way better. Your foundation brush is your best friend because you just go back in. Make sure you blend everything out so it can be seamless. Oh, I miss doing my contour down there. I'm gonna add a little bit to my nose. I was getting good at doing my nose contour. All right, I'm about to go in with the shade Vanilla to break up under my eye. And I'm just gonna put them right there because I only want the under eye to be brighter. I'm just gonna blend it out with the sponge. Keep it under the eyes. overheating because I got these lights um what else about you okay now so I stopped doing this I'm trying to get back into my new makeup routine my updated makeup routine that I started doing a few months ago and I actually loved it so I'm about to use this eight elf HD powder it's a really really fine I'm just gonna use that to set this concealer and then I'm gonna bake everywhere I put concealer it's so light. I'm not gonna press it in. It reminds me of like dust. <laughs> That's how fine it is. All right, now that we're looking like a powdered donut. I'm about to bake with the Laura Mercier. Is it Laura Mercier or Laura Mercier? Help you girl out. And this is in the shade translucent. I'm just gonna bake this one. Giving powder donut. 
All right, while this is baking, I'm gonna do the rest of my face. I'm not gonna sneeze. All this powder. I'm going to my previous place, um, Bronzer Duo. I wanna get the Fenty, um, you know, Mocha Mommy and what's the other ones? So I'm gonna use this buffing brush. This is a flat, real technique brush. And I'm gonna just, you know. I'm so used to going high. I didn't put the freaking stuff up here. So I'm gonna bronze up. I go in both of them. everything away with the Fenty Beauty. Um, this is the Pro Filter Soft Matte Foundation Powder and I'm in the shade 330. I just use this big fluffy brush by Real Techniques and this is a powder brush. I hurry up because this camera tripping. And I also just pressed in the bake that was under my eye. This place, Volume 4. This is the blush something. It's the blush duo. I'm gonna take this light pink shade, Technique Blush Brush. Like it's actually a blush brush. And I like to go up with my blush. I need some setting spray so bad, my face is so dry from all these powders. Y'all know, I like to use this. I love using this. Cause it just, the pigment pay off so good with using this. Cause you see how many times I have to do that with the brush? But with this, baby, mm -mm. Real quick. Real quick. What I'm about to do, what I gotta do next. Let me spray my face. I'm going in with the Morphe Coconut Bliss. I'm really good hair on this hair too, y'all. But it's like really frizzy. I don't know if you can tell. It's sticking up. Is it called a felt pen? Something like that. But it's this type of, you know, pen eyeliner thing. And I'm gonna do my eyebrows. I like to do hair strokes. Hopefully I don't mess up while I'm trying to zoom in. Now the battery about to die. Good lord. This is gonna be great. Hold on, y'all. All right, then my eyebrows, they're not my favorite, but it's it's whatever. Um it's a very pressed powder. And I just press it up under my eyes, just to make it a little bit brighter. And I don't go back in with setting powder. I just make sure I put this in really good. Man, if this wasn't so freaking filtered out, you'd be able to see, for real. You just press it and make it as seamless as you can. There's some storage out. What is this? Oh my gosh. Is my lens scratch? <sighs> okay. For lips, this is lip liner in the shade Hot Chocolate. Like, blend out your lip liner before you put on lip products.
taking Honey Love by MAC. It's this like mauve pink lipstick. I'm gonna go back in with the lip liner just to bring some color back. Where's my lip brush? I don't have my lip brush. A lip smudge brush. And I'm just gonna take, I don't have um, boy bait, so I'm gonna use this Laura Mercier, Laura Mercier <laughs> lip, lip gloss. And this is in the shade Rose. Yeah, here's my like detailed makeup routine. Um, I wish I can really see, but the smoothie feature is ruining it, so.